Recently, I have made Fusion 360 tutorial for beginners how to make pencil holder out of primitives. You can check that video right here if you're interested in 3D modeling. So today we're gonna talk about how to make your 3D print like a finished product. Hi everyone, welcome to the Max 3D Design. And today we're gonna make a pen holder that will look good on your table. So let's jump right in. So after we finish our design, let's print it out. Basically that's what come out of the printer, here you can see leftovers from the actual support, layers on the top, you can see them pretty clear. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna sandpaper everything, then we're gonna put some filler, then we're gonna sandpaper again, then we're gonna spray it with the primer, then we're gonna sandpaper the primer and then we're gonna spray with the black color and then add silver to the balls so that they look like a metal. So let's see how it's gonna look like. So that's how it looks like after the sanding, which pretty much no change visually, but I can feel it's a little bit more smooth. Now I'm gonna apply filler and let it dry. So now when everything dry, we just need to sandpaper it. It is quite hard to reach some places, so that's why you will have to do kind of slow one move at the time to make this everything smooth. Well, I can say it was really challenging to sandpaper this model, but when it's now, let's say, ready, we're gonna apply primer and then if we see some little holes, we're gonna apply filler again. So that's what we come up with. So shiny. So now what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna put the tape around so that uh, I can paint only these spheres. So that's how it looks after the taping. I don't know, I'm not professional, but I left kind of two balls only. So now I'm gonna give a little touch with the sandpaper in order to remove dust. Okay, so let's spray it with black and silver together. I don't know, I'm not the professional painter. Can I even spray with two different sprays? So let's try it on. So now we're gonna leave it for a couple hours to let it dry. So this is our final result. Basically put your pen inside and it will hold it. Turned out not bad, I was expecting to be worse. I'm not the best painter, um, but looks okay. So as you can see, it's really worth for post-processing your projects, especially if they mean something for you. For me, this pen holder, it's just my first tutorial video for you guys. That's why for me, it's kind of special and I decided to make it look like a finished product. For those who haven't subscribed, please subscribe and have a great print.